Hi guys, welcome back to the Funky Evolution Party. I'm Alice Green and this is Jade. Um, today we thought that uh, since the sun came out, the fairies have really been wanting me to do an episode on skin. Now, um, this is a really sensitive topic that I really wanted to cover in a sensitive way, but not really because it's just a load of bullshit. Um, and today I really want to talk about how intelligent your skin is and how unintelligent we are by going about this game that was actually a 17th century blunder. So if you do a bit of research on anthropology and why we are separated in terms of races and why certain races are more important, it was to make themselves feel more important. But once you understand the essence of your skin, i.e. now um, I'm in the sun and that is light and a reflection of light, your skin actually sees in technicolor. Um, and although pigments are more dominant than others, i.e. brown eyes are going to be more dominant than the blue gene. So in all fairness, what's more superior is the brown gene. Um, but I'm not going there. What I'm actually going with is the fact that your skin is a receptor. Um, it's, I want everybody to watch, um, I'll put it in sort of this video, um, the interview with Bruce Lipton um, and Russell Brand, and that was really interesting about how skin is actually the receptor and it tells, okay, this is what I need from my environment and that, you know, okay, I've got my, my vitamin D or if you're putting, if I put oil on my skin, that's gonna absorb in, it's gonna send those messages. So your skin is actually a lot more intelligent than this game that we keep playing. We are all of color because we are the light spectrum of electromagnetic energy. And when you look at the spectrum, it's like a, cal a color palette on your screen. There is every single color there, just variates in some when you cut your skin it bleeds we all scab up the scab looks the same the scar looks the same when you are actually looking at the intelligence of skin you will start to understand that we're being very stupid about it and um, I'm actually really disappointed that we keep on this game that is actually segregating us even further when our skin is so intelligent and our environment is consistently being poisoned and that's why we feel so crap. I'm actually gonna do another episode on psychosomatic um, causes and, and how our environment, as your skin receptors, are picking up stress. It's sending stress through the body. So, you know, back in the old days, they did light therapy and that I believe is gonna start coming through a lot more in terms of the way we heal holistically because light, <laughs> our electromagnetic energy it is all those colors in the spectrum and that light therapy actually helps to heal any blockages and all of that and that's why sitting in the sun oh my god I should have done this episode earlier but I've been busy chilling um, and that's what we need to start to understand that once we expose ourselves to the Sun which is why the pigmentation is darker it's a UV protector it's not because someone is more superior or less it's about your skin reading what is happening around it feeding those messages to the brain and then you know that's that's the purpose of your skin um, and also there is um, you know is a Hoffman I'll, I'll again put it down in terms of going really cold and you know shocking the heart and the skin and that's the receptors we need to start understanding the importance of this and like you can change the color I'm sorry I've only got like lipsticks and eyeshadows to demonstrate this um, but you know if I want to go pink this is a canvas skin is a canvas that's all it is you know and God's creation <laughs> you're a piece of art that's currently covered in a load of bullshit and once we start to understand that you know what are we putting onto our skin all those chemicals all those things what the skin's absorbing 
uh, we washing too often and therefore taking all those receptors away there's so much to understand about the skin and all we're doing is just being real fucking idiots about everything and still believing that it's about superiority when really it's about art and it's about understanding your canvas and that dermatitis <laughs> all those disgusting skin diseases all of everything is the same it's just a pigmentation and it doesn't mean that our one percent difference which is also the one percent same i think it's that we're one percent all neanderthal and we're fighting over the one percent difference which is our canvas um i don't know about you guys but i'm gonna leave you with this note because i'm a twin carrier and if i had a partner um from a different country that was darker skinned and my children one was born white and one was born dark would that make them any less and me as a mother would i then have to categorize them and i want you guys to think about that in terms of equality we all come from the same produce the same eggs the same sperm everything is the same and this canvas is your artwork how you dress it what you do with it how you express yourself to the world it's not based on your self-importance there is no superiority and again if there was it's the darker colors that overshade the lighter ones so instead of playing this silly game of a 17th century blunder of science and if you all want to get scientific let's start to understand our skin let's start to see how beautiful and wonderful and amazing and sophisticated it is compared to us and what we're actually doing in terms of tearing each other apart making each other feel bad degrading each other like all this inequality and injustice based on what what are you fighting for we have been alienated we have been rejected we have been pushed away why because of your canvas guys let's get real let's get a bit raw about this let's understand being a little bit more thick-skinned about the way people look or perceive you i am gonna do an episode on not giving a fuck because i think that's really really important for people to understand is that you are an individual the decisions you make should be made on you doing your best not what others think is your best but you and that is getting smart you know um joining the alien nation let's start this love evolution because it needs to kick off and it starts with you and it starts with me and it starts with us going hey wait a second light color what is that all about you know how is it that my skin changes color in the sun or you know i glow or when i put oil on i shine things happen to the skin that we are so unaware of and until we do a bit more research and start listening to the right people all it's picking up in its reception is poison 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 in the creams poison in your food i'm gonna leave you guys with that let's not storm each other based on anything else but let's storm the powers that be um and you know who knows maybe we can get some justice brought to the table and understand that we are all perfect wonderful beautiful creatures and you'd be really pissing god off to say that one was better than the other because you're all a piece of art so um get it painting uh please like share get the message out there leave me some comments tell me what you want me to cover cheers